Kulak House, Kulak. Kulak House is situated in the grounds of Mercy College on St. Brendan's Drive. It is thought that the house was built around 1798. It was not as big then as it is now, but the estate was still large. Originally, the entrance leading up to the house stretched almost as far as the present-day entrance to Chanel College. There were also several other buildings on the land, such as a coach house, stables and a gate lodge, which is a small house at the entrance to a big property or estate. In 1809, a wealthy man named William Callaghan bought the house and came to live there with his wife Catherine and a young orphaned woman. The young woman's name was Catherine Macaulay. Catherine had come to live with the Callaghans to keep Mrs. Callaghan, who was ill at the time, company. They got on very well and eventually the Callaghans adopted Catherine. The Callaghans believed that they should help the poor and sick in their area. Catherine assisted them with this work and also taught some of the local children in the gate lodge of Kulak House. When Mr. Callaghan died, he left the house and land to Catherine, which made her a millionaire by today's standards. Catherine had been upset by the poverty she had seen, and she wanted to set up a centre that would educate and give shelter to poor girls. She sold Kulak House and its land. She built a large training centre and refuge on Bagot Street, which was opened in 1827. In 1831, this became the first Convent of Mercy for the Sisters of Mercy, the new religious order Catherine had set up. The Sisters of Mercy spread throughout Ireland and the wider world. Today, the order is still involved in education and in helping people in many countries. Catherine Macaulay, who had become the first social worker, was honoured for her achievements by having her picture on the Irish five-pound note for many years. Kulak House was bought back by the Sisters of Mercy in 1955. They set up a convent, a small infant school, a primary school called Skull Katrina, and Mercy College, a secondary school, in its grounds. Kulak House became a convent, and some of the Sisters of Mercy still live in it which would probably please Catherine very much.